item to go through it. It helps you, Ooh. but you don't need it. Off to the races here in this first one, and we are on board here. Uh, Waluigi just prominent in the scene right now. Um, so hidden stats, no down, no downside to running Waluigi, huh? Uh, not really. It's just like with other characters, you got the lightweight characters, the smaller ones like you see in Koopa there. Oh, Slop Gun unfortunately getting dragged out. <laughs> Looks you like got, Koopa's <laughs> doing just fine. <laughs> you got Koopa there where he's gonna he's gonna get mini turbos a lot faster, but the top speed is just not gonna be there. He's gonna go so much slower than the person who's on that heavier loadout. So. I wonder if he wants us to call him an exclamation point if he's got if he just, <laughs> is, think, is that, maybe that's a solid snake reference. There you go, there you go. I, I think exclamation point's fine. I think so. I think so. I think you get angry at that one. Slappy Gunner, though, gonna be able to uh, go through that item box, use that mushroom, and roll for two more mushrooms in hand. Banana has a mushroom, not playing on his own name. Come on, give him what he needs. Banana, oh, he gets banana, a fireball. Banana. Ooh, okay, nice snipes out there with the fireballs. Goodness oh. gracious, great balls of fire coming for 13, but just gonna ward the problem. Now 13 going into the second lap has nothing to avoid that. Oh, ball. he has to use it though. That's very smart, but uh, didn't have anything anyways. He would have dropped it anyway, so I think it's very smart. Yeah, I mean, he could have just ran into the banana to dodge it. I mean, quote unquote dodge it. Yeah. It's actually the same stun timer. It just gives you more of a forward momentum to get your pace back going. Sky Gloomy though uses the mushroom to get past that shortcut. He's gonna get that ramp perfect timing. Might have enough to get past the line depending. Yeah! Sky Gloomy grabbing first place. Looking fresh on the screen as well. Love to see it. One of those competitors um, who just, you know, a little bit newer to the yeah, scene, yeah. but still came out here and is showing that he can compete with the rest of them. Might be new to the scene, but first place is what we're looking for here if you are new to the scene and hopefully can continue on and get some more. Points. Yeah, exactly, exactly. And like I was talking about, it's all about those points. With semifinals, then it's top six moving forward out of each semifinal. So the points don't matter really that much, you know? It's who's but, line anyways yeah, after that, huh? <laughs> It really is. And then with these qualifiers, though, if you don't get enough points, you will be seeing yourself in that second chance battle more likely than not. But going in this next map, where do you want to go? Uh, I want, I, you know, I want the turnpike. Ooh, uh, I like F-Zero, F-Zero nice. great game. I, I, I love the game. I love the track aesthetic. I don't like the map. It yeah. is very, very hard to catch up on this track. Because one, they're just one time I ran into Jadex uh, just out doing something, and he was, I was like, what are you doing? He's like, playing uh, playing F-Zero. Oh, like, really? Oh, wow. I was like, the map? He's like, no, the game. Oh, <laughs> I, I, do they have F-Zero on the emulator? Yeah, or no, it's on the, it's on the Switch. Oh, like my the, God. You know, like the little, uh, Oh, just a couple of coins there, not really what daddy -O wanted, so now he's going to sit in 12. That is going to be hard to come back from, but maybe he'll get an item to mix it up here. Yeah, the thing with this track, you're seeing it, there's just boost panels on boost panels on boost panels on boost panels. Oh, that green shell just bouncing on top of exclamation point. Oh, he doesn't go for the double there. Weird. And then the thing about this track also, everyone will have 10 coins practically. Like yeah. Those little side panels, they give you the additional coins you need, so it's so hard to just have a strategy to catch back up on this track. You don't have like a, like there's a bullet extension on this track that will automatically give you first place, but if you're not gonna have that going into this last lap, you're not gonna have a good time. I love the gray Yoshi, I've actually never seen that. Yeah, you know what, like, it's, it's more or less white, but yeah, you know, you got a little gray tint there. But... Might be all the dirt that he's picking <laughs> up here. Getting through to this first and second, third place. 13, still doing his thing, but uh, has to kind of ward away this Shell. Now he's gonna to get to bump draft and does find a bomb, but I don't know if he has the speed to catch up now. Sir, nine, another returning better Gonna go for the no item shortcut and oh, he lands it! That Let's was go! A sick backflip and gets the extra speed from it. Now he's gonna pass that line. Gonna give a little wave to the fans as well. Uh, genuinely, that is one of the hardest no item shortcuts to land in this game. He might have done it one handed. <laughs> Jackie Wars though right behind him with the double red Aronis of Doom, but it doesn't matter. Gets the boost panel, goes all the way back up to top speed, has another red, gonna be holding on to it just for a little bit of safety as 13 uses the fire, gets rid of that red shell. Now gonna throw a little bit more forward. And another double. Oh no. That's red gonna shell have a got red himself shell. a defense. Okay, Sir Nine. 
That is actually, uh, that's a good loadout there. He's gonna try for it again. No! This is it up. Keep your hands no. on the wheel. You, you know, Wait. It's, like, uh, it's so easy Might to mess it up. Possible double kill here, no. No, 13, Blue Shell's not gonna finish. be able to catch up in time. Hey, Blue Shell absolutely nullified there in that one at the end. Could have uh, just been a little bit quicker on that one and we might have seen it. Yeah, that, and genuinely great work by Sir9 landing that no item shortcut. It's pretty difficult to do because you have to be at the exact right angle, use the exact right hop, and you saw it. Literally his back tire, his left back tire, yeah. caught the edge <clears throat> of the off-road, which just turned him yeah. and made him lose all of his momentum. So genuinely, though, great work by Sir9. Unfortunately, hopefully he still got a pretty decent spot, but still props out to all these racers who are just doing a magnificent job tonight. Honestly, magnificent is the word. I've been seeing, you know, last second passes. We're, we're seeing everything we need to see here. Love what's coming out uh, from Bear. I feel like Bear always throws a, like a, even when he's in first, he'll throw like a couple things in the back just, oh, to, yeah. just to stir the pot. Oh yeah, no, there's so many times when I was competing and those backed items especially on the final lap you're just like you're so focused on racing and getting around all the other racers especially on the final lap you're not expecting it ruined my chances from so the many line times. too uh, speaking of we got excite bike we're coming up Ooh. to do you like this track it's definitely I think one of it's my favorites right. i think the rng mud and the different yeah. kind of the switch up that happens on the track is, is definitely something to look out for yeah no i i call it the big boy baby park because it is very simple it's just a ton of tricks you got the dirt paths you you got those, whenever you have a mushroom, you can go through it. It's very easy to catch back up on this track as well, as you can see that Dry Bowser is going to have to do after burning out. But for the most part, this is not the most favorite track because everyone picks it like online competitively because it's just so easy to get yeah, like you're seeing right there. Just use a shroom, go forward, grab yeah. first place. I like the line that uh, Zul has for himself here. He's grabbing a lot of coins, but last second finds himself oh, in the grass. God. Touch grass, gamers. <laughs> you can see he's not happy about touching that grass, though. Oh, a little bit of mudding the the waters here for the Tanuki suit. Ooh, grabbing that double item box goes through the mud. You really want to try and avoid that. It's going to slow you down just a tiny bit. Nothing too crazy. Not like Mario Circuit where it's going to spin you out, but Ooh, does it Ooh, I like this item? though. Uh, That's the real way to touch grass. Oh, yeah. I've never oh. even thought to do this. How funny. Yeah, no, going off the side. Oh, and just narrowly avoids that green that connects to another competitor. Using the golden mushroom to go off on the side does gain you so much time. And then you just avoid all the chaos beside you. That was so cool. He's like, I'm not even using these jumps. I'm getting the straight path. Going to get that top speed. And good, good for him, because that sucks that he even fell into the, into the grass. Oh, absolutely. Now Jackie Bar's got to avoid that. Oh, he has a star. Got to pop it. Does that mean shock in play? Grabbing a shock that soon, or star that soon, and that, you know, not even that far away from first place. Will a uh, shock be in play? Star or Michelle Mario. is down. It connects with that Waluigi. Yeah, got a little Metal Mario love here for our 30th anniversary, but God, Sports Joey, one of the one of the fan favorites here. Oh yeah, definitely. Always, everyone wanted to move for him to grand, get grand finals. And genuinely, Jackie oh, was. That could have been that could have been a messed up <laughs> banana to put there. Would have been unable to get the box, but he saves it for the defense. It looks like he's gonna get in first place here. One of the racers that just has that veteran status. I was that, gonna say the know, same status thing. Status quo. Slappy Gunner though, Ooh. with the smiles, grabbing second place. Talking about Jackie Wars though, genuinely just has that calm composure from being here every single week. He saw the banana, took control of his cart and got around it and was able to finish in first place with flying colors. Yeah, I'm the, the colors being black and white checkered for that first place. Um, I, I'm really enjoying all of this. I've, I've been having a great time here hey, with yeah. you, man. Uh, honestly, this is, this is the reason that we come out here to the HyperX Arena to get hype. Exactly, to get excited, to, you know what? Like when I was growing up, I never imagined True. being able to have a place like this, True. to have a, a whole arena to be able to compete 
not only for feels money. feels like a dream every it, time. It does. It does to not only be able to compete for money, but to meet up with new people, new friends, people from all across the country coming here just to say hello and play this single game with us. Dude, God bless. Um, I think it said that we are going to Big Blue, if I'm not mistaken. Yes, Big Blue. And this is, this is a really interesting one. Our first section-based track of the night where you're going to see a new part of the track in every single lap. It's not a circle. You see okay. the mini map. It's chaotic. And Wait it's a second. Stupid. So I got another thing, another bone to pick. That's what I'm out here doing. Oh. Mario Party King. I actually played Mario Party against this guy. Oh. I must say, he's a Mario Party King. Is he? <laughs> I, I have yet to get to play against he, him. I played a, he's pretty a good. Bomberman against him, and he absolutely ruined my day yeah. there. But <laughs> I, I have yet to play Mario Party with him. I really want to one of these days. So hopefully I'll be able to. But I'll have to say, I'll avenge you, no man. Thank you. Name. Thank you. That's <laughs> what I'm looking for. Um, but into this race, it looks like we got a little dry bones Bowser. Getting some uh, coins off of that track. Landed Sir Nine oh! with the grab and another one. He has just been so good at some of these track uh, mishaps. He, it seems like he's off the track and then he's right back. These maneuvers that he's doing are absolutely. absolutely bonkers. And I uh, just read in the chat, happy birthday to Sloppy Gunner. Ooh, happy yeah. birthday to you, buddy. Grabbing that second place is going to help you out a lot there. But going this final lap, Jackie Mars using the mushroom, grabs that double item up somehow, and gets oh. hit by the red and throws him off the stage. Going to drop him down all the way to fifth place. You can see place. his face, though. Absolutely veteran. Knows he's in third. Has to keep going. Has to just keep on holding the gas down. Sky Gloomy getting dragged out, unfortunately. Didn't notice that Ooh, banana. Good jump from Fort Joey. Joey has that protection he needs to grab second place. Misses the one drift, but has another ready to if go. If anybody lands in front of him, he's going to let that thing go. <laughs> nice. Grabbing second place there. And banana oh, nah, grabbing nah, nah. first. Yeah, shout out to the minions. Banana. <laughs> you know, minions are kind of hype. Some, you know, honestly. They should they put them in the game. <laughs> They're kind of like shy guys, to be they honest. They really are. A little bit. A little, a little bit. Odd shy guy skin or something. I, I, I did love the memes for uh, uh, the, Despic the new Despicable movie. Just everyone going in suits and stuff yeah. like that to go see the movie. It was so goofy and funny. Yeah. It made me respect Minions a little bit more. It grew on me. It did. <laughs> um, let's get into some highlights here to our next uh, one. Uh, I'm excited so for that, that next match. That was ridiculously match. good, man. <laughs> Thanks, man. Holy crap. Um, but yeah, 13 definitely had his way with that last track. But on this one, we saw the one time that Sir Nine made it but couldn't get that second time. So close to getting that. That would have definitely netted him first. Oh, yeah, absolutely. And Zol then, now getting dragged, ooh. lag trailed into the off-road. Had to hop himself. And then himself. pulled it back. And uh, you can see the other side of how you actually use this grass to your advantage. Yeah, it genuinely having that it, golden mushroom. It, in my mind, isn't that good of an item. Yeah. But on Excite Bike, you're seeing it when you're flying past all those jumps that are slowing down other competitors. Yeah. It is so satisfying. Yeah, and it's it's one of those like kind of expert level. You know, you get somebody new to Mario Kart, they might be able to figure out, you know, certain other items, the piranha plant, the bullet bill. But when you get that much speed at your disposal, they can yeah. sometimes shake a lot of people. Oh, it does. It does all the time because you're like, you don't expect it to you're just, just launch you. Slamming shrooms in the Yeah, exactly. Num, 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 num. Exactly. You don't expect it, but like you're seeing, even with the regular mushroom, it just kind of catches you off guard if you're not used to it and not ready to really take control of your car. It's going to fly you off the stage. Yeah, well, uh, I'm not flying off the stage anytime soon here. Let's go ahead and check out these standings for that last qualifier. You got Mario Party King in first, looking like the Mario Kart King as well. Jackie Wars. Whoa, spoke. that is insane. These yeah. are some low point totals. Yeah, the, I mean, you had Jackie Wars. This this is just proves that, you know, these guys were slugging it out. Sports Joey in that seventh might have to go to the qualifier, but 30 points nonetheless is pretty good. Uh, had 13 in that last one. Daddy-O wasn't able to get it done. The little bit of the older competitors might be getting past. Might be Dr. Mario time for them. Who knows? But we will know who's going to go to second chance battle very, very soon as we just got done with the very last qualifier.